This is a quick video on how to use a custom action to create a record using the Adalo external API. Um, so if we look at the database, I've got a records collection with a name property. I've got a form input where we can enter a name uh, or any, any string and then a submit button. On the submit button, we create a custom action. Uh, and before we do that, um, let's get some information we're going to need. So firstly, um, go to your settings, app access, API key. So you can regenerate that, but I've already copied it. So you want to copy that. Secondly, go to the collection where you're going to add a record, click the three dots and go to API documentation. Okay, and you're going to go to post, add a collection record. Um, on your button, you're going to create a custom action um, like this, but I've got one set up. Um, and it's going to be a create action. Method will be post. Your base URL um, comes from the documentation we opened here. Um, it's this endpoint up there. Um, header is going to be authorization, bearer, space, and your API key. Um, if you've copied and pasted your API key, try removing the space and adding it again, because I did have a problem with that, and deleting and um, making the space again fixed it. Um, secondly, you need a content type application JSON header. And thirdly, for the body, um, here, it tells you the payload you can use. So you can copy that and put it in the body here. Um, I'll mess that up. Okay. Um, also, um, you're probably going to want dynamic data, so you can use magic text there. And then run test request, test successful, save custom action. Okay. So then if we preview my, my button has disappeared that is very odd okay um, so on the input I'm just going to need form input input okay um, testing testing submit and then if that's worked we can check our database and we've got testing testing so it is creating the records okay any questions let me know thanks